Hi, good day. In this video, I will teach you how to view or to use administration window in Aldrin POS. So, I will give you the um, link where you download the Aldrin POS. So, here, this is the downloaded file. Then, extract this uh, file. So, after you extract, this is the project built in NetBeans IDE. Then open the project, Aldrin POS here, download, then open the project, then let's try to run this project. I already um, execute the database here inside the Aldrin POS. So this is the window of the POS, for example, uh, uh, cashier then cashier this is the username and password then let's try to log in oh there's there's an error here below so let's read okay so the password is okay um yes so i'm like um i'm using the correct password but maybe there's a problem here in um, db connection here so let's change to my password that's my old password from other pc so okay let's try to run but the password is correct so let's try to log in again then okay so can log in okay so in this uh, window we can okay so here in administration we can see user to user here which is cashier and administrator so we want to view the administration administrator window so here so let's view again which is the username and the username of the administrator administrator is admin then the password is let's see the password is maybe admin okay so let's try to log in run again then let's try to uh, log in and admin admin so log in so it can log in to our um, our window. So here, this is the uh, administration side. If you want to add um, products here, so select supplier which who supply that product, then add product. Every product. Okay, for example, this is uh, existed product Graham's or uh, Presto. So here, if you want to add a new product, product settings here. So let's add product. For example, if we add product here, then if you are using barcode reader, then um, here. Okay, so that is um password oh no barcode of the product so we don't need to waste time to this so let's proceed to our cashier maybe if some um uh viewers uh doubting with a uh, doubting of this uh, point of sale so you can change let's change this barcode to real barcode here so update so let's update this grams then to the barcode so it's okay scan then update the barcode yes then let's proceed to um to cashier um window so here so update then let's assume that this uh, p 
picture is the picture of the product of uh, grocery so let's log out okay now there's no log out in administrator so just copy the code of uh, cashier so let's exit here so run I will not complete this project because this is a free so if I complete this project maybe some of the viewers uh, edit then they can sell the project so if it's up to you if you are using this project and then you can complete and then you can sell the project so let's proceed to cashier we are done uh, changing the barcode so let's uh, log in so here let's try to dispense uh, product okay for example let's use the barcode reader okay okay uh, three times I scan the presto then this time is let's scan um, Graham's for two times no it's hard to read the barcode okay two times then that's how it works it works in um, we don't need a text box to to put our um, our barcode because uh, th this is automation so this is the design of point of sale is it's already what whatever you scan and then it responds to the product equal to the barcode of the product so this is how it works aldrin point of sale so in next video i will teach you how the skin or look and feel of this point of sale use so thank you for watching and see you next video bye bye